Hi guys, here in this video we are analyzing June 2019 chemical sample problem on molar ratios whenever we are given with HNMR data. Visit and join chemmasters.online for the best concept oriented online courses on CSIR, GATE, JAM and all other chemistry computer examinations. Now just come to the point of the question. Reaction of styrene with HBr gives a mixture of regioisomers A that is major 1 and B minor 1. The HNMR spectrum of the mixture shows 4 signals among others. So just look at the 4 signals with relative integration of 2 ish 1 ish 1 is 6 respectively. The molar ratio of A and B is. So here to give answer for this problem first of all we need to understand the information given in the problem. Okay, so here styrene is reacting with HBr. Okay, so that is the first step. I am producing two products. One is the major product and one is minor product. Okay. Yeah. Now, which is the major one? Simply we can say the first one as a major product because it is Marconic of product. Okay, and second one is the minor one because it is anti Marconic of product. Okay, right after producing the major and minor products, we need to look at the HNMR data. Here, there is no chemical shift values in the range of 7 to 8.5 ppm. That's why we can simply ignore the protons of benzene ring okay here we have 5.17 3.53 3.15 2 ppm chemical shift values so we can say all those values should belonging to these terminal protons okay right now after determining that just uh, try to assign chemical shift values on the products so here 5.17 belonging to this proton because here the carbon which is directly connected with more electronegative bromine and also phenyl ring which can accept electrons for the delocalization okay so that's why electron density decreases around this carbon so whenever electron density decreases around that nmr active nuclei then its chemical shift value increases so 5.17 must be with this proton only or simply with that CH only okay right and adjacent CH3 should have 2 ppm value okay right now next uh, minor product so here the CH2 which is directly connected with electronegative bromine should have higher value we can say 3.53 for it and uh, whenever the NMR active nuclei are far away from that more electronegative atoms then chemical shift values decreases further okay so here this CH2 should have 3.15 chemical shift value okay so after predicting chemical shift values on appropriate uh, HNMR active protons so just try to take them here we can say 5.17 right I next 2 ppm value I next one for this minor product we can say 3.53 and 3.15 so this is for major product A and this is for a minor product B after that just try to take the integration values so 5.17 belonging to integration ratio value 2 so just take it 2 here and then 3.53 with 1 so here 1 and 3.15 with 1 so here 1 and 2 ppm chemical shift value belonging to 6 integration value okay right after taking this now so we have the formula to find molar ratios here that is we can say m x by m y so here just consider x as major product and y as minor product okay so mx by my equals to integration of x by integration of uh, y 
or simply integration value of x by or intensity value of uh, y okay right and now sorry into so here then uh, n x by n y here n indicating number of nmr active nuclei which are producing or relating with the integration or intensity value okay now just consider i am just uh, looking at the first value of major product 5.17 here is the 5.17 okay so which is having intensity or integration ratio value 2 so here mx by my equals to 2 by so with uh, here is the ch now just consider we need to consider this ch2 okay so for that we have chemistry value 3.15 so 3.15 belonging to integration ratio value 1 so just take it 1 here now how many number of protons are relating with that 5.17 here only one proton is there okay ch group okay that's why 1 by here how many protons are relating with that chemical switch 3.15 value so simply 2 okay so 2 here so 4 by 1 indicating 4 is to 1 here answer is the second one so try to check other uh, H number active protons for this so the terminal CH3 here so CH3 belonging to chemical switch value 2 and uh, 2 is belonging to integration ratio value 6 so here 6 by for this CH2 belonging to 3.53 so which is having integration value 1 here so 6 by 1 into so how many protons are relating with that uh, chemical sheet value 2 3 protons are there so 3 by here 2 protons here 2 so 12 by 3 resulting 4 is to 1 okay so simply second option is our answer so just remember this formula okay right and uh, if you are interested just visit chemmasses.online and join the best uh, concept oriented courses to get the guaranteed success thank you very much